Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Bravo News. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. It is officially over for the Valley stars Brittany Cartwright and Jax Taylor, as she has filed for divorce. This comes on the heels of his exiting the mental health facility he had been in for less than a month. So what does she say in her filing and will this impact the show? Keep reading for more details. At the end of January 2024, Brittany Cartwright moved out of the Valley Village home she shared with Jax Taylor. Yet they did not tell anyone but fans were suspicious. They saw photos Brittany would post and noticed that they were not in her OG home. On the heels of the Vanderpump Rules spinoff, The Valley premiering, Brittany finally broke the news. She shared she had left Jax to protect her mental health and their son, Cruz. More so, she maintained that there was a lot of work Jax had to do in order for the relationship to have a chance at working. Many fans believed it was a publicity stunt to promote The Valley, but they maintained it was not. Cameras even picked up to catch cast reactions and Britney's exit from the house. Jax claimed that he was getting help and seeing a therapist, but he canceled the appointment. It proved it was all for show and then... The new season was ahead. He already had drama with cast members and was seen arguing with Danny Bucco in his driveway. That was when he checked into the mental health facility, but it was not enough to save his marriage. According to TMZ, Brittany Cartwright filed for divorce from Jax Taylor on Tuesday, August 27th. They were together for nearly a decade and married for five years. Their anniversary was in June, so Brittany headed to Las Vegas to celebrate. That was where she originally met Jax. She cited irreconcilable differences as the reason for the split and the separation date as January 24th, 2024. Brittany wants primary legal and physical custody of Cruz, three, but is amenable to Jax having visitation. When it comes to money, Brittany Cartwright has requested that Jax Taylor not be awarded any spousal support and she does not want any either. When Jax was on House of Villains, he bragged that she brought home a $2 million payday for her Jenny Craig endorsement deal. She had also talked to Sheena Shea about how they struggled when she was the breadwinner. There was allegedly no infidelity, though they had faced that in the past. In season 6 of Vanderpump Rules, Jax was unfaithful, but Brittany took him back. This will likely play out in season 2 of The Valley and hopefully there is a reunion this time around. Are you shocked Brittany actually filed or was it just a matter of time? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below.